Hey audio engineer, this is Mr. Goldschmidt. I want to give you some helpful tips with writing in your chord progressions and working on your ringtone melodies. So I've right now decided I want to use this apocalyptic controls uh, synthesizer and I'm going to play in my chords. I'm going to use a one, five, six, four chord progression and I'm going to play these in using the MIDI keyboard. And I'll stop that there. So I've recorded in this progression and I want it to just last for eight full measures. Now if I look below, I've recorded pretty well in time, but what I'm going to do is I want to highlight all of these notes and I'm going to quantize them just to be sure. I'm going to quantize the whole notes and I'm also going to extend them all since they're all highlighted. If I grab and extend those, it'll move them all so they last the full measure. And then I could go back and hit play and everything records nice and clean and plays nice and clean. Now if you don't want to record those in uh, each time, what we can do is we can oops, I'm gonna undo this down here, is we can um, create a region and then I can double click on that region and I'm gonna zoom in and I can click to write my own notes. So I wanted a one chord which is C and, and I can see my C over here on my key. Here's my E and here's my G. So I write a C an E, and then a G, I've created a one chord. Then I can go over create a new region, I'm going to create my five chord. Then I'm going to create another one for my six chord. So this way you don't have to write in your notes with the keyboard. You can just pull it, you, you don't have to play them with the keyboard, you can write them in on your own. And back to the four chord and then I can take all of these and I can copy and then paste and extend my track as long as I want to extend it. Now at the moment I have all of these individual boxes I can merge these together to create my loop and be able to loop the big chunk all together instead of having to copy and paste the little ones. So now I have my chord progression like I already just recorded in over here. Right now I have a melody I just recorded and it sounds like this. What I can do is I can take that melody and I can double it. So I'm going to right click, I'm going to hit copy on that. I'm going to go down to this German lead sound and I'm going to paste that melody down below. And if I hit play, I get both of the sounds playing at once. I can then take that sound, and if I go into my editor, what I'm going to do is I'm going to highlight all of those. I'm going to hit copy, and if I select a different line, I can paste and double that melody. So again, I'm going to hit copy on that. I'm going to whoop, 